Audi A8 suspension lowering with VCDS. So we were looking on the forum how to do it, but I didn't find a video at least on this model on the 4HO because this is 2011. Yeah, so 4HO if your level control module is like that, number 34, this is gonna be for you. So we want to lower it just a bit more. It was lowered before, I did it before, but I'm doing this for testing purposes so you guys can see. And first, what you need to do, you're gonna open the adaptation and then you're gonna go to the channel body height front, <coughs> body height left front wheel house edge. You're gonna see this one is 426, standard it was 406. So if you wanna lower your car, this number has to be increased. But don't think that if you're just gonna lower you change the number now it's not gonna work there's different steps that you have to do before you can change this number it's not gonna allow you because I tried so you make a note of this one I usually take a picture of it save the number so what I want to do in here this is been lowered 20 millimeters but I want to lower four more okay so what I'm gonna do instead of 426 it's gonna be 430 this will be a round number here and if you look on the rear, so you got body height left front wheel house edge, body height right front. What you're looking for is one of the rears and one in the front. And see the difference, what you had and what you would put. You need to have these values just in case. Ideally, people measure with a ruler, but I just go by this ones, so I'm not gonna have to do too much work with it. So take a note of this one if this is 24 to 7 before it was 407 millimeter right so we increase it with 20 and now we want to put in here same as the front just because it's gonna have to be four millimeter which means if it's four to seven it's gonna be four three one so it can be even number front and rear yeah so remember take a picture of this one before you do anything and then I have put my instructions in here because it's not very easy but you're gonna hear me when I'm talking so first your car has to be on auto to be able to do that if you're gonna have a look in here so we're gonna put it in auto right select it let the car do its thing right engine has to be on do not open any doors if you really want to do this and you want to get outside, open a window and get out if you need, but don't do, don't open any door while you're doing this. And you need to load up VCDS, then you're gonna to go to module 34, level control module, right? And see some people, they had 384, and they're from factory, which means it depends on the value, yeah? So, what we're gonna try to do now, we need to go to security access before you do anything, right? The code is there, 2103, 20103. Okay, do it. Security access, and then you're gonna go to 04, basic settings. Here comes the phone. <laughs> Here goes the phone down with my notes and basic settings and then you're gonna go to zero activate level control right so activate level control system hit go finish correctly and then you wait for not running okay gonna wait for not running and then you can click stop and after that you're gonna go delete calibration for level control in the same basic settings delete calibration for level control hit go you're gonna hear an error yeah wait for it to cut hit go wait for it to complete your car will throw a fault code and you'll see an error message stating air suspension malfunction this is normal okay 
So you wait for not running and then you're gonna hit stop and then you're gonna have in here at least in the instructions that I had it says startup reference level and then hit go but I don't have that I have set reference level and do not use the startup reference level production yeah so do not use this one okay so you have to use set reference level some people have it different but do not press this one because it won't work yeah so set reference level it's just gonna hit go aborted safety reasons not running stop calibration for level control go we wait for this one not running stop and then set reference level go aborted safety reasons probably the compressor is to too hot now so we have to turn off the car and we're gonna come back so what we did is because uh, we were playing with the suspension it got hot I had to turn off the car so you set reference level you're gonna hit go that's in basic settings continue to what we were talking before and you wait for it is because if you play too much on the pump don't try to do it too many times you have to let the air pump cool down a little bit so we wait for running now, it's gonna take around a minute, this one. Suspension goes up and down, up and down. And then we're gonna wait until... Finish correctly, yeah, you don't do anything yet. You wait until you see not running, all right? And then we're gonna hit stop, and then... Now we're gonna close this one we're gonna go don't go back adaptation we're gonna go to body height left front left right so you're gonna have to do left right rear left and rear right all of them one by one so what we had before if you remember we're gonna put the value in here it was four two six in the front so we're gonna put four three zero yeah, so 430 in the front. I'm gonna hit do it. Yes. Accept it. Right. Take it one by one so you can not gonna forget. Body height right front wheel. Right. 430. Do it. Yes. Okay. And the next one rear left remember we put 431 now because it was one difference one millimeter before the, between the front and rear red 431 okay and one more four three one so we lowered the car four millimeter Now, the next step, after you're done entering adaptation on all four wheels, select go, go back and return to 04 basic settings. So go back, basic settings, and now you're gonna go to basic settings, basic settings, select calibrate level control, calibrate level control. Hit go, running. You wait for this one to be finished. T 
this is basically in real time so you can see what's the required time but just take it easy and read everything I I did this before so it's gonna be easy for me for you just take it easy and read everything finished correctly you're gonna feel car going up and down and stuff like that when it finished now it's not running so that's the time when you're gonna click stop when it says not running okay and now calibrate level control hit go this is done and activate level control again last one active level control system hit go running finish correctly and then not running yeah so this is all done I'm gonna hit don't go back all codes there will be errors in here clear codes yes so no errors now if you're gonna go to adaptation you're gonna see that the values in here they're what we put 430 this is the real one now 41 so this is exactly what we wanted don't go, don't go back and that's it thank you very much